Tipping Plus studied the transition of 20 coal and carbon intensive regions from 13 countries around the world, spanning to Europe, Asia and North America. This video delves into the transformative journey of Upper Silesia, the largest coal region in Europe, home to 4.5 million people, of which 72,000 work in hard coal mining. In 2021, for the first time in history, the Polish government and mining trade unions agreed to phase out steam coal production in the region by 2049. This decision forces the replacement of coal in the national energy mix and causes labor market changes. The regional authorities embarked on a territorial just transition plan which crafts the vision for a green Silesia to foster economic diversification and provide jobs in modern industries and services. Recognizing the challenges faced during this transition process, efforts were made to support workers in mining-related companies who often experienced greater vulnerability to job losses compared to miners themselves. To assess the indirect effects of coal phase-out, Tipping Plus researchers applied a novel approach using publicly available data to present vulnerable job scale, structure and location. Our findings indicate that up to 52,000 jobs in mining-related industries in Upper Silesia are at risk. 80% of these jobs, mostly in manufacturing and construction, are within a 20-kilometer radius of active coal mines. Drawing from these insights, the Tipping Plus research team proposes three key takeaways. One. Policymakers should pay attention to and support less recognized entities, such as indirect companies related to coal activities, to help them diversify their business model. 2. Workers should be provided with tangible employment alternatives in cleaner industries, ensuring in parallel good working conditions. 3. Publicly available data at the company level should be closely monitored to track and manage their transition process effectively. Learn more about Tipping Plus and our case studies at tippingplus.eu and subscribe to our social media for news and updates.